Greetings, friends. As fall settles in around us, we find ourselves moving into a new season of ministry. We, as Mennonite Church Manitoba staff, are praying for you all that this ministry year will be life-giving, filled with learning, love, and even some laughter along the way. Your regional church is also moving into a new ministry year. We have lots going on for you to participate in. Secret treaty events, a pastor's retreat, a webinar on cultivating generosity among us, opportunities to gather for shared meals together across congregations, faith and life choir visits, MCM Mondays, youth and young adult retreats, our 2025 gathering, and more. Check out the MCM website for more info on these and other events. Last spring, we launched our Camps Capital campaign, Light the Fire. To this point, we've seen donations and pledges approaching a quarter of a million dollars. It's a great start, but still a long way to go. And the Light the Fire committee is hard at work tapping those shoulders. Thanks for your continued attention to supporting this shared ministry we so love. MCM is in a time of transition. We've emerged from pandemic protections and the uncertainties that those brought, but we find ourselves in the midst of other challenges. Increased living costs, of course, but also ongoing declines in membership numbers, aging congregations, an increasingly secular society, generational shifts in theology and values, and more. Our moderator, Cheryl Braun, has some exciting news to share about an initiative we are launching to help us walk into an uncertain future, yet still God's good future, together. I am pleased to announce today the launch of Hope and Courage, a two-year visioning process approved last spring by the MCM board. This is a chance for us as congregations to take stock of how we're doing, who we are, and where we're going both as congregations and together as a regional church. This visioning process will involve a web survey available to all, focus groups reflecting on the diversity of MCM, and our 2025 gathering focused on some core aspects of our identity as Mennonites. One outcome of this process will be the development of a new vision statement for MCM, if that's where our work takes us, and a series of three-year strategic plans to move us as a regional church into the future. See the Hope and Courage webpage for more information, including how you can participate in one of the focus groups in the coming year. Step up and join us as we venture out in hope and courage into God's good future for us all. This is a tremendous opportunity for us at this turning of the times to reflect together on who we are and what God is calling us to be and to do. I add my own encouragement to Cheryl's for you to participate in our hope and courage visioning process as you are able. If you want to stay up to date on all the things going on among us as a regional church or you want to hear stories of what's been happening, be sure to contact our office to sign up for our weekly MCM update and our MCM monthly newsletter. And if you want to support our shared ministries through your financial gifts, please be sure to first give to your local church and then to MCM. And know that 30% of those funds will be forwarded on to MC Canada for our shared nationwide work. May you find joy in the journey this year. Take care, friends.